Hey everybody, I'm JJ Johnson, and today what we're going to do is we're just going to take a look at a couple of different kinds of uh, glass breakers that you'll find on the back of a lot of EDC knives and stuff like that. So uh, the two knives that we're going to take a look at is the SOG Escape, and I actually got this uh, out of uh, the, uh, the Echo Sigma Runner kit. I did a video review on that a little while back. And then um, we've got the Schrade, the A911R, which is, you know, basically a, a knife that's made for cutting seat belts and breaking glass and, you know, car extrication and, you know, stuff like that. And this is a pretty cool knife. It's got a uh, spring-loaded uh, glass breaker on the back of it. So what I'm going to do is I've got uh, a couple of car windows here, and we're just going to break each one of the windows using uh, these different knives. So the first one I'm going to go ahead and do uh, is I'm going to use the little punch uh, on the back of the SOG Escape and all I'm doing is just closing the knife blade holding it like this and then I'll be you know punching it with my hand. Notice I've got some leather gloves on um, I'll be keeping my face away from it so you know no glass comes out or anything like that too. Um, when you do this Ideally, what you want to do is you want to find a corner, usually the lower corner. Um, upper corner is, is better than doing the middle. Um, you want to find the place that's going to have the least amount of give in the window and strike it there in order to break it. So I've never uh, actually broken a window with one of these before, so I'm not sure how this is going to go, but we're going to go ahead and give it a shot right now. So I think I'm going to come over here to kind of hit it right there. harder than you think. Alright, let me try it in this corner. There we go. And kind of what I did uh, on that one, just to keep my hand from going through uh, the window or anything like that, is I was hitting my wrist right on the corner of the trim, you know, right in here so that it was kind of provided a stop for it as well. And you've got to hit that, you know, pretty hard to get that to break. So, um, kind of interesting. And it actually did dull up the point a little bit on that, uh, on that SOG Escape as well. So, this also has a uh, seat, butter, seat belt cutter uh, on it. So, we're going to go ahead and try that as well, see how well that works. And the same with uh, cutting the seatbelt with the other one, too. So, let me go ahead and set this up on another window so we can break the other uh, window for uh, with the Schrade A911R. Okay, guys, so um, kind of awkward positioning here, squeezing between these vehicles and stuff, but uh, this is the Schrade 911, A911R, and like I said, it's got this spring-powered punch on there. So I'm going to use that to uh, break this window and see how effective it is. Put it down here in the corner. Didn't work that time. You know what, I think I was doing that wrong. You gotta actually probably pop it all the way back and lock it in place here. And that way it's got more spring to it. So I probably should have read the instructions manual. <laughs> all right, so let me try it now. That cracked it. Try it down here in the corner more. That's put a big chip in it too. <laughs> and there it goes. <laughs> Uh, 
<laughs> so it works. Uh, you just got to use it the right way. Um, yeah, it's it's kind of tempting to where the storage position is right here, and you can pop it up and it'll still pop out, but it doesn't have enough velocity. You've got to actually cock it all the way back so that you've got it back here, and then you can go. So that is how to use that. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at uh, how this thing will cut some seat belts while we're here. Okay guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you the uh, seat belt cutters on these two knives, the Schrade A911R and the uh, Saug Escape. And I've kind of got a section of seat belt over here. Hopefully you can be able to see that. I'm gonna cut that with this one. and. And it cuts it pretty good. Actually works very well. Uh, let me go ahead and double it over and cut it with the blade portion. I was using the, the seat belt function there. All right, so cuts right through that like butter. And let's go ahead and take a look. See how the oops, wrong knife. See how the sog does. Kind of hold it up here. And I'm just using the back end of it. Kind of almost got to keep it straight. Got to get at the right angle to get it to go. Um, seemed like it was a little tougher. And then for the uh, blade portion, cuts through that pretty well too. Not bad. So anyway, guys, this has just been a look at a couple of different knives. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna take them down to the bench top and uh, give you guys a closer look at each one of these, kind of show you some of the differences in them and all that kind of stuff. Anyhow, guys, I really appreciate you coming out to uh, watch this video, and I definitely appreciate it when you click the thumbs up button, when you share it with your friends on Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus. And don't forget to live the six P's. Proper prior preparation prevents poor performance. Stay safe, guys.